What's up, YouTube? It's Adam from Miami Music Mogul, and this is the part two of two for Beginner Shortcuts in Logic Pro. Now, I'm going to continue on showing you some more shortcuts in Logic, and I hope you enjoy them. More tutorials coming soon, so keep an eye out for that. Let's get to it. The quick way to bring up the mixer window is to hit X on your keyboard. This brings it up. You can adjust it by going just under the scroll bar in this little white area. So you see this arrow up and down. You can adjust the size, so you can adjust your volumes, and you can turn on and off your automation. Anything you can do in a mixer window, just hit X, and there's your mixer window. To bring up your piano roll, which is basically your MIDI editor, just hit P on your keyboard. This shows you your MIDI data, and from here you can adjust or change or do whatever your heart desires to your MIDI information. There are a couple ways to loop in Logic. One way is to, well, first select the region you want, hit the L key on your keyboard, and now you have looped that region for your entire song. Now, sometimes it's not good to loop something for your entire song, so then in that case, you'll use this method. Just hit L again to undo the loop or take off the loop. Select the region you want. Go to the top right corner of the region until you see this little symbol. It's like a little 360 circle arrow thingy. Click, hold, and drag. Now this allows you to set how many times you actually want the region to be looped. And again, if you hit L, you can take it off quickly and easily. Automation. All right, I'm not going to get in depth in the automation in this tutorial. That'll be another tutorial. But I'm just going to show you a quick way to bring up the automation window. And that is by hitting A on your keyboard. So this, when you hit A on the keyboard, it brings up the automation for all your tracks. And from there, you can obviously adjust your automation. And then hit A again to close the window. As always, like I always say, there's always a couple ways to do things in Logic. Now, one way to zoom in and out in Logic is to hold down your Apple key on your keyboard. And to zoom in and out vertically, go to your arrow keys on your keyboard. And the up and down arrow key is to zoom in vertically. And obviously, the left and right keys is to zoom in horizontally. mute the region, hit M on your keyboard. And that mutes that region and hit M again to take off the mute. Simple. Another way to move this cursor uh, left and right within Logic is to use your triangle brackets left and right. So triangle left bracket on your keyboard will scroll it to the left and triangle bracket right will obviously scroll it to the right. Class is now out of session.